Or what? Driver's license? No, I lost my driver's license. Hold on. He takes out the passport everywhere, so I am. It works? Yeah, no, trust me, it 100% works. Yo, are we saved? You guys see us? Okay, that's why. <laughs> Took some mad convincing. Yeah, but, bro, anybody on that Vegas, tra one of the biggest travel right. destinations in the world. The <laughs> live U battery died, unfortunately. Straight up. I didn't yeah, charge it last night. I tried charging it a little bit today when I woke up, but it wasn't enough. They would always have to go I di It died because I didn't charge it last night because I was super drunk. But it's okay. Because I got my phone. So, no worries, dude. Shitty quality, but it works. It helps. It helps. It helps. It helps. It helps Remember. It helps way more. Professional. Yeah. Fucking pictures. It looks yeah. the same kind. There's a college ID. Like, yeah. Yeah, no, nah, college ID. If I was the manager. I'd so, be. look up that VOD where I snuck in. Not now, but when you get home. The look, it's a fucking amazing. What, what, what are you sneaking into? He was with Sam Pepper. I, I snuck into, into VidCon. It was VidCon, but they were like, it was like a Fortnite thing. Oh, shit. Well, I remember they, seeing that. But, but like, like I was saying, though, it's hella bullshit. Like, I got 80 community hours yeah. because uh, I, never got trust, I never got trespassed. So they just kind of fucked me on that one. Right. I was about to say, did you get arrested from that? I did. What did they charge you with? Trespassing? Trespassing. Got you got any boom, boom. I know. I, I shouldn't have even got charged. Boom. I never got trespassed, but you know, I wasn't gonna fight it, dude. Yeah. The mic is covered, yo. The mic's not covered. The audio on my phone just is not good. All right. All right. I appreciate it. Thank you. This is the first ever time I've ever been Oh, dude. Out. Okay, so yeah, we'll have to show you all. Wait, why, why'd you get that face? Is that you've never seen this hookah before? Yeah, they usually don't bring up the tall ones. They usually do a shorter one that sits on the table. Yeah. Uh, but he gave us the big dog. If I buy, if I buy the big, if I buy the big, I'm going to have to give this guy five minutes. Bring it in. Bring it in. Yes, it's Streamlabs Watermark. I don't stream on the phone chat, so. so really, it's, it's this or nothing, all right? I don't have a choice. Like $10 for the beer or something. $15 what you should do is say, hey, I'm going to run a gas station. It's like, I'm not going to get you beer, though. Walk in with a water, and then I'll give you my jacket, and you just have a beer in your fucking pocket. You Wait, you can drink? What do you mean? You can, you can bring your... See, the thing is, what I'm debating right now is I want to go ahead and get a beer, but they don't sell beer here. They have beer at the convenience store. Yeah. But uh, they charge you $5 to, to bring... Have it. Yeah, to have it here. So if I go to the convenience store, they're gonna hit me over the head. They're gonna charge me like ten dollars for a blue moon. I won't bring it here. They're gonna charge me five more dollars. So I paid fifteen dollars for a fucking blue moon. Okay, I mean to be fair, if it's five dollars for a pack of six, that's still cheap as fuck. It's not. No, I think a convenience store. I think they're gonna charge me like. Well, you you got LA prices. You could probably get a six pack here for ten bucks. Oh my god. Welcome to uh, welcome to Texas, baby. It's yeah, like five dollars is nothing, well, bro. It's not twenty bucks a sheet. Bro, I thought, I thought... Well, I got Charmin Ultra. That shit's like eight bucks. Yeah, hey, you gotta wipe your ass and, 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 and if there's anybody out there, get a fucking bidet. You fucking nasty ass Neanderthal animals. Bro, I use... I use Do you have a bidet? Yes, clean. No, you bro, don't, dude. So you come to my house. I have a portable bidet. You fucking bought a portable bidet. Yes. You can just use wipes. So you, don't, you don't use wipes. Like I, like, wipes. I like the water one. I mean, it's the same thing. I mean, I Why would you... What's the point of a bidet? Clean off your asshole. They do it in like, in like Uruguay. When I went to Uruguay, like, bidets are everywhere. You go to... <laughs> Off your Selena Gomez is on Quiet Down. I use a brand of water <laughs> called Bro, I, I tried wiping my... Or I tried. I went to Japan and the, the you know, Japanese toilets put they water... Yeah. It, no, no, no. They put the, the... The toilet comes up with like a fucking tube and it puts... It goes in your butthole and it puts water in. I tried that. I could not, dude. I felt like, nah. Shit in my... <laughs> shit. Shit in my ass, I can't, dude. And then it drips fucking brown, I can't, dude. It's I get on my get to my leg, and I can't, dude. Because when I have shoots like this really concentrated stream, and you can choose the power, so you can turn it up all the way to eight or two is usually pretty good. But I, it just feels so much cleaner, man. It feels so much cleaner. When I did it in Uruguay, I loved it, so I was like, I gotta keep doing this. I can't be a fucking animal anymore. And my buddy got one, and then I was like, fuck, I'm gonna get one. You don't put it in your ass? Well, I didn't put the tube in my ass, chat, but you don't, it, no, you don't it just, the, the water went in my ass, and it was fucking... It's fucking uh, straight stream. It just doesn't in, in, feel good. In India, they literally just shit in the street. Oh, they don't <laughs> shit on the ground. Wait, can I... Yeah. Right there, they, they, what are we, what, what are we, a fucking herpes? Come on. I mean, the yellow. Why don't we should all just use the same one? What, we have herpes. Use your own, motherfucker. <laughs> bro, y'all are whack. 
<laughs> I always share with the homies. Yeah, and that's where they get sick. <laughs> do I look? Do I look sick to you? Not yet. I mean, I took a bite out of his tuna sandwich. It tastes like shit, but fucking. Oh, I wish I brought the phone selfie stick. Here, I'll, I'll hold it for you while you hit it. Can you see that? Yeah, here, just, just flip it. No, it's flipped. Bang bang. No, it's flipped. Oh. Like, no, dude. No, like, just turn the phone around, Lunar. No. No, like, you know. Yeah, like that, like that, like that, yeah. Is it upside down? <laughs> no, 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 you're good. It's good. I mean, it doesn't look upside down for you, but the viewers... We should pass down. the camera. Oh, wait, I'm gonna right? jump. I'll jump right now, and I'll tell you right Here, now. How, how about I hold it? I'll there be the camera, man. By the way, everybody's on the picture. There we go. Can you guys do O's? I can. There's a really easy way to make a small hole, and then just yeah, tap on now. your cheek, and you we're go... Now. And we just do O, 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 like really small. Small at all? Actually, I'm gonna just go get a chair. It's close. There you go. Your mouth is kind of shaped like... Oh yeah, no, I was. It was sold out. The other chick was somebody backlash. Herpes made her get What? Did she have herpes? Yeah, she had like something else. Who the fuck was selling it? Who was selling backlash? Who was the freaking chick? What's her? The Venus app. It had to be a. Hell, dude, you, you don't. They're saying muted. No, it's not muted. Okay, somebody said muted. Yo. Um, chat, if, there's no way she has herpes. Okay. It's good. There's no way she has herpes because. Somebody got something to drink it. She wouldn't be famous. What's her name, though? Say that just for how do you have herpes as a as a famous person, dude? How do you get herpes in general? I mean, the signal is dog shit, guys. It's like two bars, so yeah. I mean, I can still I mean, see the string. It, it looks good on our end. Right? It it's just it kind of like zozos a little bit. How good is your connection? But that's because it's two bars right here. Oh, uh, it's two bars. Yeah. I mean, it's fine. It's, yeah, it looks good. On it, it's, it's not gonna be. It's high either high. this, guys, or nothing. What do you prefer? So yeah. there you go. <laughs> Yo, mod, just, yo, if you're, just time out people complaining in the chat, I'll be real. I can't mod, so. If anyone's complaining, just time out. I'll just put it in sub mode. It's not <laughs> but they, you can't do that, in, you can't do sub mode. <laughs> so what you can do, Steve, is grab that table right there, pull it up next to you, and you can just sit it up right there. Like, nah, nah, it's good. I'll actually just go get another comfortable chair. Hold on, guys, sorry. Let me get another chair, because I'm fat. Oh, you're getting a better chair? Yeah. <laughs> Let me take that shit. I'm gonna hit a blunt. Who'd you want? You have yours? Yeah, I got it. I got it. I don't know, chat. <laughs> how, how many people in the chat have herpes? <laughs> like, because I just don't understand. Like, how do you get an STD? <laughs> I, I don't. I don't think herpes. Just wear a condom, dude. Yeah, herpes is a mouth STD or a vagina STD. The audio is low. I mean, well, because there's no wide angle. Like, okay, here, I'll get closer. Uh, yes, yeah, so here's someone fucking. Is no, I just coughed because oh, like. Oh yeah, he just coughs <coughs> normally. Not hookah. No. I met a guy last week that has it. I just don't get it. I met a guy last week. How? We'll just how dick some yeah, but how do how do you know that guy ha that that guy had? Did it? you see his paperwork? Yeah, like did the guy just tell you you have herpes? The guy in the chat who says, "Oh, I know. I met a guy last week." How do you I'm know? So far. 
me see. Here, you got your phone? You're using it. Oh, yeah, that's the S9? No, no, that's the iPhone. You didn't bring the S9. No. My phone is broken. <laughs> is that is that Gary's? No, this is the phone that I used in uh, the climb a mountain with. But when I fixed it, it didn't fix the phone. It's internally broken. That's and I'm not, not spending I, I'm not spending eight hundred dollars on a new phone because I don't really stream on a phone anyways. Yeah, you only use it for calls and texts. So I don't really you know what I'm saying? I don't really need to. So I mean, fuck it dude. Yeah, no, the iPhone X is great. Like I'll stream from this, it's so crystal clear. Hey, you want me to hold it again? No, I got it. I just want to be able to see you the from Streamlabs? What are you going from? Streamlabs, yeah. Yeah, it's not bad. Yeah, oh, I dropped the phone. This phone was dropped in a river. Beautiful. And it still works? Jesus Christ. Yeah. But that's why the microphone's fucked. Oh. Uh, but I, I got the microphone fixed, mm -hmm. but it's internally fucked anyway. Like, there's no way to fix it. Yeah. Well, you went all the way up to fucking Japan, so maybe the fucking, the high density air fucking crushed it a little. The moisture's a big deal on phones, too. Like, if you shower with your phone, like, get all that heat and moisture in your phone, you fuck it up. He doesn't shower. I fucked up a, beat, a pair of Beats headphones, because I would get out of the gym, set them in, like, the shower, not the shower with me, but, like, in the bathroom, and then the steam just fucking ran they just stopped working? They just stopped working one day. And, and then they checked it out and they were like, yeah, there's a bunch of moisture in here. They're like, are you like in a jacuzzi with these? Why is it so so much condensation? I was like, oh, fuck, I left it in the bathroom. I don't know. I used to do that all the time. I put my laptop in the shower with me. Yeah, it's not a good idea. <clears throat> Never got broke. Yeah. I think Beats are a little more cheaply made than laptops, though. So. Yeah, I used to have Beats, but they're trash, though. They're trash. Because I bought Bose headphones after that. And they Way were... better. Yes. Bose is thousands. Did you already drink that? Huh? You already drank it? Yeah. Quick, I need to see you take a drink of it. I'm already feeling... I chugged it. You will feel a buzz. I'm already you feeling lightheaded from this. Oh, who's who, got it? Okay. So I don't know how you're not feeling lightheaded right now. Oh, you will. That's what I love about it, dude. A little bit of lightheaded never hurt anybody, man. Come on, let's be real with it. You know who you look like? You look like uh, the guy... They do a whole... You and there's another guy with glasses. Super oh. wholesome. What's the guy's name? You know I, who I'm I talking know, yeah. about, right? Well, they've had, they ate the Carolina Reaper. They do like tech reviews. Yeah, they do a whole bunch of shit and they're super fucking wholesome. Yeah. He looks just like the guy. Who are you talking about? The guy I don't know. The guy without the glasses, right? Exactly, yeah, the guy glasses. without the glasses. Yeah. He looks just like him. It's two guys and they do like random reviews of shit. Like if you saw him, you'd be like, oh, those dudes. One dude's kind of nerdier, darker hair, glasses. Other dude looks kind of like me. Brent and Link? Awesome. Yes, yes, um, exactly. Morning? Yep. Yeah, yeah. Brett and Link, or oh, yeah. it sounds like that, yeah. Awesome, yeah. Thank you, Mark. CX in the chat. Carolina Reaper's awesome. Yeah, 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 Good Mythical Morning. They have some good shows. Is that, I, I, yeah. I like them. Yeah. yeah. They're good, they're good shows. I've been watching them for years now. You should 100% stream with them. Do you think you look like Weird Al? Uh, yeah, I think I look like Weird Al. Yeah. Yeah, he looks like Weird Al. With well, his hair down, he looks like Weird Al. Do you think I look like Mr. Bean? Yes! Uh, <laughs> Mr. Bean. <laughs> Are you trolling, right? No, you look like it's like the steps out or some shit. <laughs> like, no cap, you're not like, you know, just you like... Really what it. about... Back yes, to... dude, if Kramer and Mr. Bean had like a threesome with like some back alley chick and had you. <laughs> Why's it gotta be a back? Oh my crackhead! Why's it gotta be a back alley chick? Why can't it be a normal? I think the worst thing I could say, and I thought back alley was pretty bad. So. I don't know. I don't think I'm. I don't think I'm Mr. Bean status. I mean, yo, he's a nice actor, but he's fucking not attractive. That's what I'm saying. Like you're, you're his stepson. So I'm less attractive you're than Mr. Bean. No, you're more attractive than him, but you Mr. still. Mr. Bean is your like, dad. Yeah. You always look better than your parents, right? I look exactly like my mom. Really? Yeah. So your mom's Mr. Bean. No, my just give me my answer. mom's not Mr. Bean, but my mom is like a vagina version of me. Same height and everything. No, she's five ten. Oh, wow, your mom's tall. Glasses and um, muscular. Hmm. My mom. Used to be muscular. Hmm. Yeah, my mom benches more than I do now. Hmm. Mom's a beast. She squats like three hundred. Well, women parents are bodybuilders and fitness. Are you serious? Your parents are bodybuilders? My dad's a bodybuilder. Well, he used to be. He's, he's like 60 now. He still looks good. He can still bench like 300. Damn. My dad used to be able to bench like five, 600. He took roids for a little bit when he was like in, in his 20s. Fucked his liver and kidneys up. No, I mean, he just went bald, but... 
he used to be a bodybuilder. My mom is in a CrossFit. Oh, God, that's so hard. So my parents are super, like, healthy and shit. That's yeah. why I started working out. But now, I, now I'm, I smoke hookah and fucking weed. And I, yeah, I'm, I'm not anything like the, the, the stream my life parents now. Him. The stream life is good, you <laughs> Never asked the chat if you should have one more. Why are you zooming on my nose? Nah, it zoomed out. <laughs> His nose is taking up like 50% of the screen. <laughs> oh, God. But, uh, yeah, I mean, I don't know. What were your parents doing? Dude, my mom and dad were struggling musicians. My dad was like a construction worker, and my mom worked like a bunch of different like doctor's offices, like dermatologist. She was like a just like an assistant for a really long time. My mom, at, I remember uh, she told me this a couple months ago. When I was like from the age of like six to like thirteen, she was only making nine hundred a month. How doing what? Th- that was how much she made. And doing what? Like she was like she was an assistant in a dermatology clinic. She Why did? Was- they- Small town. Taylor Swift is and I feel guilty listening for free. Uh, 900 a month supporting a kid, which is like, how the fuck did you make that? Welfare. We, we weren't on welfare. She made like a little bit above that, so we couldn't be. How's 900 a month not on welfare? She was married. So they would combine our earnings with my dad. So we actually made like, but my dad was like a drug dealer idiot, so he would just squander all his money on drugs. Is your dad in prison? Uh, he just got out. Okay, that's good. <laughs> My, my, uh, that's very similar to my family. My parents, my parents and my grandparents are the only people in my immediate family that are not in prison. Damn. I had some cousins that did some mafia shit in New York, and they were super rich, and then they got arrested, and the police took all their shit. Uh, and then my uncle sold, uh, he sold drugs and pills and stuff, and he got arrested for trafficking, like, 200 oxycodons. So he was in jail for like 10 I years. I say that's a good 17 years. I think he just got out of prison after like 10 years. Damn. Uh, I have my I have other cousins, but they're in Germany, so they just live there. Right. I don't even talk to them. I have no idea what they're doing. That's a really long way away. And then, yeah, my grandparents, they had a business, and then my parents do their own thing. So, yeah, everyone else in my family is in jail. I feel you, dude. Or dead. Oh, yeah. One got hit by a car. One had a heart attack. One... Had a heart, another one had a heart attack. They, I, yeah, many heart attacks in my family. Yeah, you need to watch your diet. Don't my, a ton of red meat. my, yeah, well, heart attack runs in my family. Yeah, so. My, my grandfather died at like 40 from a heart attack. Yeah, he used to smoke like four packs a day, though. Okay, that's why. Yeah. God yeah, damn, you gonna pass that hookah, Stevie? What the fuck? <laughs> He's had that hookah for a while. <laughs> the fuck? Sorry, just trying to. My cough reflex almost gets triggered. It's getting, a little, getting a little harder now. You don't really smoke hookah, right? I don't smoke at all. He's like, I only smoke. I only vape. Why do I have so much caffeine then? Well, I mean, I'm confident that I won't have a heart attack, but everyone in my family is. My dad. Muscular, so that doesn't help his hypertension, but. Die of a heart attack when I'm like I know, I've 60. Because I believe if you think about it, you'll like actually might predict it. Because did you know Pistol Pete? Like he was like, I don't want to play in the league for 10 years and then die of a heart attack at 40. He played in the league for 10 years and died of a heart attack. Years. Like, I couldn't believe that, but like, it'll fucking happen. If you manifest that shit, you never fucking know. So I say never talk about when you're gonna croak ever. Well, I think manifestation you talk about is crazy. It is, dude. What do you mean? Manifestation it's like is right? crazy. It's like I say. It's like you saying four years ago, I will be a successful streamer. I will. When you've only got one person watching, it's like you speaking into existence. I never said that. Well, you might have thought it. Who knows? Uh, I'm, this is hypothetical, damn it. You're ruining my metaphor. Manifestation's uh, crazy. But it's like Conor McGregor. Did you ever see him right, like building up to all these fights? He was like, I know I'm going to be the fucking UFC champion. I'll be the middleweight champion, whatever, whatever. whatever. And he became the middleweight fucking champion. You have to speak into, into existence. It's a, Gary Vee talks about it. You know about Gary Vee? It's called auto-suggestion. You keep telling yourself something and eventually, oh man, I'm living this story. So. Did you just mention Gary Vee? Yeah. I don't know what the fuck you guys are talking about. Y'all are some boomers. You, <laughs> ma- you mentioned you mentioned Gary Vee, right? Hold up. You got the Gary Vee shoes. <laughs> who the fuck is Gary Vee? You don't know who fucking Gary Vee is? Why are you ruined? <laughs> He's an entrepreneur. He's a really, really solid entrepreneur too. Solid, heavy. He he owns Vayner Media. He's his companies. 
future. Yeah, everything's valued. I think he's at value at probably like six, seven hundred million. Chad, do you believe in manifestation? In a couple years, I bet the dude buys the Jets because he's talking about buying the Jets. I feel like people who talk about manifestation are people who are already successful and they put out bullshit into the world to make people feel better. Possibly. I mean, it could be. I've done it. Though. I don't think this dude would be talking about manifestation if he didn't have 700 mil. And I think he was talking about manifestation when he was Chicago. fucking doing YouTube. Well, he was doing YouTube I'm for Terry years. Dye right now. He was doing YouTube for years. And was like, I don't know if What's wrong with you, dog? I don't know if this is hookah or what. <laughs> no, I don't know. I mean, I would like to I live. I would like smoke. to live until 100. I tell myself that because my grandfather lived until 94. Like but he didn't smoke, drink, or anything, so he was the only one. Everyone else in my family smoked cigarettes, and they fucking, you know, died. Right. Just don't drink cigarettes. Drink cigarettes. Don't smoke cigarettes. Yeah, I don't. Only in Japan did I smoke cigarettes for a little bit. What's, well, like, really cool? Because they had really good fucking cigarettes well, in yeah, Japan. Well, yeah, it's like a thing out there. It's their culture. Yeah, yeah. They're really in cigs. Here, it's terrible. Gary V. sent me those shoes. Really? Yeah. That's fucking tough. Yeah. He did a... He did a drop with a uh, collaboration with Adidas, and he sent me those. And the new one, oh man, I don't know why. What happened? I don't know, what's up? Did you get some smoke in your eye? I don't know, but... Talking about those shoes, gets you emotional. It's, I don't know if it's the hookah <laughs> or what. It's touching your heart. But, I did have a... are watery, right? Yes, they're very watery. I had a heart attack before. How? Oh. I drank five Monsters in under an hour when I was a line cook. Insane. It wasn't. A, I don't think it was a real heart attack. It was like a semi heart attack. Like heart palpitations? Your heart's fucking beating at nine miles, ninety miles. Away. No, I had to go sit in my car. When, so I was doing the fucking line cook shit. I was super dehydrated. I was working for like fucking ten hours, and I drank five monsters because I was like, All right, I'm fucking so tired, and I'm, but I still gotta work. Yeah. Five monsters under an hour, dude. Super dehydrated, super hot, super sweaty, in a yeah. fucking kitchen, super steamy. Yeah. Went to my car. I told my dude, I gotta go to the my boss. I gotta go to the car for a second. Went to the car. And I just, I sat there. My whole body was in se- severe pain. And I just couldn't move. I was hard to breathe. It was fucking terrible. And I just sat there for like 30 minutes. You snapped out of it? And then I got better. Damn. I knew a kid in high school that drank six Red Bulls before a, a basketball game. Put himself in the hospital. What happened? He just went, I don't know. He just went to the hospital. He made it. He didn't die. My actual... Bro, you're like... Bro, what's wrong with you, dog? I don't know. You're I, like the, wet. I think the hookah got in my eyes or something, but <laughs> it's better now. At the beginning, it was tough. Now, yeah, now it's burning less. I'm getting a runny nose from it. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's good to you. You want to yeah. pass that or you want to? Well, yeah. <laughs> you want to hold on to that or? Yeah. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> yeah, so I mean, I don't think it was a real heart attack. I think I had like a semi fucking caffeine overdose or something. But that's probably what it was. You know, I just, it was rough. I got scared. Whoa. I don't know what happened. I don't know, but it hit me hard. What do you feel right now? I'm feeling better, but at the beginning it was hard to hold my eyes open. But this, this has happened from time to time. I just, you can't just wipe your eyes and be good? I do that. The, Sonic Girl just Snapchatted you. Hey. I yeah. can't fucking Snapchat looking like this. Hold on, let's Snapchat this. Hold on, wait, wait, hold on. Wait, don't do some crazy shit. No, let's Snapchat you it, bro. Back <laughs> what, you care that much? Let's go, Snapchat it. Dude, Moises, come on. All right, hold on, wait, let me see what she said. You, you got a smiley face, I see a name. Let me see what she said me. I need to be able to open my eyes and see something. Moises, how long? What is, what is going on with you, man? Oh, a photo of her dog. She got a Rottweiler. Hmm. Have you, why have you not hung out with this girl yet? Huh? I haven't hung out with her. Let me, let me, uh, let me. Fuck, Stevie, wait. how do I get back to where? He's pulling oh, that up now. What is it? I don't even know what happened. It's just some random shot. Let me see. What is it? Is it there you go. Oh. Weird, bro. He's gonna slide up. Bro. Big fan of the stream, bro. Oh, how are you, bro? Uh, hey. Wait, let me go back. I gotta go back. I think that's it. Hey, wait, let me go back. Dude, you have no idea how to do this. I'm not used to Snapchat. You definitely are a boomer. I'm not used to Snapchat. Let me see. I'll do it for you. No, no. Hey, what's up? Don't mind the water in my eyes. We're smoking hookah. And this is the guy 
that was in the car was smoking hookah. That's why my eyes are watery. And I want to go ahead and just keep the streak going. So, cute dog. Come over to the house and hang out. Finally. It's been a week. What the fuck? How big is your house, Ice? It's a it's, mansion. It's three floors and it's... No, it's a mansion, dog. It, yeah, it's three floors and I think it's 9,000 square foot. We're smoking hookah. The hookah's pretty hard. That's why my eyes are like teary-eyed right now. But yeah, <laughs> keep the streak going. I can't get over that shit. All right, now. Bro, you really care about this fucking streak, bro? Dude, the one that says sweet dreams. No, huh? Ooh. What's the streak of you messaging this girl or something? Yeah, but man, the sweet dreams puts the sweet, sweet dreams dream on top. Closer. But it doesn't put the filter on. It just says sweet dreams up top. Well, yeah, you don't want to put a fucking real filter. Like what? This is a nice like, filter, right? Are you a woman? It's nice. All right, I'll put the, I'll put the sweet dreams. And said, see what she says. Who's that one? Who? Uh, this is a, there's a couple people I'm not used to using, like Snapchat. There's a couple people in there. Check this out. Oh, fuck. I, I wasn't Are you circumcised? 